Welcome back, everybody. This is Roger Eastlick with businesswebsiteceo.com, and we are in uh, the series of videos on how to set up the Parallax Pro Genesis Child Theme. In this video, we want to take a look at the Genesis Theme settings. So hover over on the left-hand side, the Genesis group. You'll see the flyout for, gen for theme settings. Click on that. And here are the theme settings. Now, the deal is we're going to use all the defaults. Okay, so we're not going to really change anything, but in the event that, um, well, basically, I mean, you can go to the Parallax Pro theme setup, and here they'll talk to you about um, They will talk to you about how to how to how to set up the Parallax Pro theme. All I want to point out to you is, in case you want to, it says here how to configure the Genesis theme settings. And remember, we got here by um, under My Studio Press. Then we went down to and we clicked on My Downloads, and then we went down to the. Parallax Pro, Parallax Pro, and we went over here to Theme Setup. Okay, and that's how we got to this page. Then we scroll down here, and you can look at the configure the theme settings right here. Okay, and basically what it's going to tell you, you can go and compare these settings if you'd like to. Um, really, the deal is that once you uh, you if, if if they're not the same or if you're nervous about it all you have to do is click on reset settings and then save settings again and you're good to go okay so we can go through a little bit it enables automatic updates you can have it notified if you want to um, there are different different styles built into it it really just changes some of the look and feel of it we're not going to mess with that for the color style um, you can deal with the, a default layout we're going to stick with the uh, the default layout we're not going to mess with having sidebars at this at this time. Um, and bread breadcrumbs you can turn on on these various places on the home page, post pages, archives, 404 page, the attachment page. We're going to leave that the way it is. Not going to do anything there. Comment trackbacks. Right now we're not going to do anything with that. Just so you know, it's there. Um, you know you can modify the blog page template. If you want to, and you can put in header scripts. Now we will we'll come back to this actually a little bit later on, but um, those are the theme settings. So if like again, make sure that they they show up like they do on the uh, setup in the setup thing. Otherwise, just click on reset and save settings, and you'll be good to go. This is Roger Eastlick, business website CEO.com. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next video where we will create our first post. If you found this video useful, please like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, and other social media. Thanks.